Hi everyone and welcome to Taste Test with Mike. Today I'm trying another Dollar Tree item and it's Fast Bites Cheeseburger. It says flame broiled beef patty and cheese product on a bun. Cheese product? That's a little scary sounding. Anyway, let's see. It has 380 calories, 17 grams of total fat, that's 22%, 6 grams of saturated fat, that's 30%. Mm, those aren't too great, great of figures right there. I'm just, of course, I'm splitting this with joy. But still, uh, cholesterol, 15 milligrams is 5%. Sodium, 560 milligrams is 24%. I'm surprised that's not even higher. Uh, 42 grams of carbs, 15%. 3 grams of fiber is 11%. I don't know how they have sugar in it, but 7 grams of sugar and 6 grams of added sugar. Why do you need sugar in a cheeseburger? Anyway, whatever. 12%. Uh, 15 grams of protein, that's decent. 27%. 8% of calcium, 20% of iron, that's a good figure. 6% of potassium. So this is obviously one of those things that I wouldn't eat a lot of, you know, but it'd be nice to have some on hand just for a quick lunch, maybe, or you could actually have them for dinner too, I'm sure, and uh, have some fries with it or something, whatever, potato salad. But uh, yeah, I mean, or you could make us into a chili burger even. I will be adding, we, we've got some shredded lettuce. I imagine it's still good, I'll check it. Uh, I don't feel like cutting a, a, a to, we only got one tomato left and I don't feel like cutting that to, to put it on, on this, uh, and onions the same way. I don't want to cut open an onion, uh, cut up an onion just for one piece. But, uh, yeah, I, if the, if the lettuce is fine, I'm going to put some shredded lettuce on it, mayonnaise and mustard, and that won't be really changing it around much. Uh, it's going to taste like it tastes. So I imagine this is a microwave. The best results, heat from frozen, remove from box and open one end of wrap and microwave high for 70 to 80 seconds at sandwich rest for one minute. Usually it's still cold in the middle when you fix these things, but we'll see. I mean, I'll, I'll get it right. So I will do that and I'll be right back to try out this Fast Bites cheeseburger. Okay, we have had these before uh logan said but i didn't even remember it and uh we've had i know we've had the chicken ones and the barbecue rib shaped patty one and i of course remember what they look like we've been talking about a lot about things being smaller in dollar tree or even elsewhere you're getting less for your for and paying more for it Okay, you know, these, I got this, it was $1.25, you know, used to be a dollar, had a full-size bun on it, a regular-size hamburger bun, and everything. Look at them now. Look how small uh, that bun is now. It's not even a regular size. I mean, this isn't, I mean, it's bigger than a slider, yeah, but not a whole lot bigger as far as the bun. So this is way way smaller than it used to be. I can't remember, like I said, I don't even remember ever trying one of these, but Logan said, I think he said he did. Uh, I don't, he didn't remember if that patty was still, if that's smaller or not, but that's also, I think it, didn't, it doesn't have a full size piece of cheese either, uh, but I don't think it ever did have a full size piece. Kitty's up here playing with the thing from the rep that I took off the box. Here, let me move that out of your way. She's playing with a little strip that you pull off of. So I just wanted to show you that. That's what you can expect for it to be smaller even for $1.25. Uh, it used to be bigger for a dollar. So I just get aggravated, you know. So I'll be right back. I've got it microwaving over there. Kitty's having a big time with this thing here. Watch. She's <laughs> knocking it around like a hockey puck. Uh-oh, there it goes. <laughs> Be right back. Okay, here's what it looks like. I cut it in half. 
So I put some lettuce, like I said, and mayonnaise and mustard. <laughs> I just opened a new jar of mayonnaise and Kitty was licking on the little top. <laughs> Looks like mayonnaise. Hmm. Definitely smaller than it used to be, y'all. But yet it's a quarter more. Aggravates me. At least if they're going to go up, leave the stuff the same. You know. Size. Just like those theater box candy of theirs at Dollar Tree. There's less in some of them. I don't know about every one. I've not checked every one. But there's less in some of them, some of them than there was. and they're, But they went up. Okay, I'll try one more bite. Hmm. It's actually not bad, you know. The, the, the burger patty, it has somewhat of a char grilled taste. <clears throat> um, yeah, it's, it's not bad. Um, thinking about it being smaller, number one, 380 calories. I mean, I guess if that was one of your three meals... And you didn't have much more with it. You know, if you had some fries, it would probably be more, you know, definitely be more calories and stuff. The fat, 22% total and 30% saturated. The sodium is not a real issue because everything's like that. I mean, 24%, uh, it could have been worse is the only thing I, I'm thinking about that. Decent amount of protein, decent amount of iron. I'm surprised at 20% of iron. Um, all things considered, I'm going to give it a four and that's only because it tastes good. You know, I consider everything four out of five. I go by five stars. Uh, I consider everything when I'm reviewing something and nutrition has a lot to do with it. You know, I just need to let y'all know, uh, what, what you're, what you're buying. Make sure... I know it's really hard to do, but especially if there's something that you might think could be bad for you or that you might want to eat on a limited basis, always look at your nutrition facts. You know, back years ago, they didn't have them, so to speak. I mean, they might have a few things on some things, but they didn't even, you didn't even know what you were eating, what, what it was bad for you or what. So... Let me finish this while it's still warm and give Joy her half. I'll be right back. Oh my gosh, I had to tell you what I did. I saw the bag of fried onions, French fried onions, where I made the casserole with it. The leftover one. I put some of them on the burger. It makes it taste way better. It's fantastic with them on there. A little crunchiness of the little fried onions and the not having any onion on it, the onion flavor. It's really good. <laughs> so I'd let you know. I'll, now I'll finish this. I'll be right back. Okay, she loved it. And she loved the fried onions on it. I think I come up with something. I'm going to... Next time I make homemade burgers, I want those French fried onions on mine. They got so much flavor. And regular onion, you know, you get a huge slicer if you try to put 
pieces of the slice on it, it comes off and everything. I think these would stay on better. Too, excuse me. But it was it was really good that way. So I don't really have so much of a problem with the way it tasted. Just the fact that it's smaller and a lot of fat, it's not that healthy for you and stuff. So that's why I gave it a four. But anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this Dollar Tree Fast Bites Cheeseburger Review. Taste test, whatever you want to call it. Um, I was really surprised that it was that much smaller. I thought, you know, with them being more, they would leave them. The company would have left them alone because they sell a lot of those. They might not now. After people try them, they're going to be like, they're smaller. So I don't know. But if I, I don't know if I would get it. I think I might look for it. Uh, I know, um, I don't know about Dollar General, but I know when we went to Family Dollar, which we don't go there very often, they had these type sandwiches too, and they were a dollar. Um, I'd be interested to see. They, they probably would be, they're not going to make two different sizes, I wouldn't think, you know, one for Dollar Tree and one for else people. But I mean, I'd be I'd be anxious to see if they would still or interested to see if they were still a dollar there. So I'd be more likely to buy it for a dollar, it being smaller especially, but I don't know if I'll buy them anymore for a dollar twenty five. I don't know. I, I kinda doubt it. I, I'd have to really want one like right as soon as we got home or something, you know, from Dollar Tree. If I was starved to death maybe and had to have something quick, but that's just being honest about it. I mean, I don't know. Uh, I'm still aggravated about everything going up there. Uh, I don't see it. I think they're shooting themselves in the foot. But Okay, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this taste test with Mike. If you did, I hope you'll press that like button. Also, subscribe and share this out if you haven't already. And hit that. So you get all my videos as soon as they come out. Everybody have a great day, and I'll see you later on. God bless.